Okay, hi guys, today we're here uh, and we're gonna actually look at a very basic workflow for G Technology. As you can see, I'm shooting on the Red Scarlet. Uh, I've got the Zeiss 7200 as well as the 28 to 80. I'm actually testing the lenses out and shooting in 4K. So uh, I just wanna show you application as far as my workflow is concerned because the thing is I'm using 64 gig cards, which is not a lot of space when you're actually shooting 4K content on a Red Bank. Now we all know how expensive those things are. I literally have two 64 gig cards today and I'm thinking, well, hang on a minute, how am I gonna back up all my footage? So for maybe half the cost or even two or three times less, I've got EV drives here, which are from G Technology. Once I finish shooting all the footage on a 64 gig card, I'll make the transfer into an EV drive, take the red mag out and basically reformat and bang, I'm ready to shoot again. So basically I can reformat all my drives and get maybe two or three times double the amount of footage. If I wanna be extra careful, I can essentially then back the second copy up now onto another EV drive, which I have in my pocket. And the thing about this is the transfer speeds are reliable. It's at 136 megabits per second, so I can easily get the footage off very quickly. And I can now erase all the stuff on my red cards and my mags are ready to shoot again. So I can get twice the amount of footage, three or four times the amount of footage. So I have two base EV drives now where all my footage is being backed up. I take it home, put it in my G-Doc and basically make second backup copies, third backup copies, and so on and so forth. So really, it's a simple workflow and minimal cost compared to, let's say, buying red mags that are 128 gigs and they will cost you thousands of dollars. You know what, this is the best solution as far as backing up and archiving footage in the field is concerned.